Hello guys and welcome back to the Solopreneur channel where we're here to help you escape your nine to five. Okay, so today I got on here because I had to talk to you guys about what happened to me just now when I'm working, as you can see, I'm working inside one of my websites. This is my authority site. Um, it is mainly for helping parents, parents, children with disabilities. So I'm in here on my site and I was working on um, WooCommerce and trying to get my store, I guess, trying to make it better. And you, as you can see, they have all these little tabs on here that they're recommending me to do. Um, one was to hook up with Pinterest, but I already claimed my site on doing that. But what I wanted to get over here to show you was, um, so right here, it asked me if I wanted to customize my page or whatever and it it actually turned it into a um a home page and I was like why is it doing that it turned it into the front page I did not want it to be the front page but it turned into a front page so I'm going to show you what I did to get it back to its normal front page because I have spent pretty much the last, I would say, 10 minutes trying to figure out how to undo the stuff. And um, I found one solution online, but it really wasn't self-explanatory. So I'm going to show you guys. So if you just go down to where it says appearance and you go to customize, uh, I'm going to show you what my homepage had looked like from the beginning when I had so this is what it had looked like when I had clicked to customize on WooCommerce. I know I shouldn't have clicked it, but I did it anyway. So I wanted to see what would happen. So I actually have a tab that says shop. But okay, when I click on shop, this is what my shop page looks like. But when you click here back to the home page, it was coming up like this. And I don't want it to look like this because for one, I think it looks ugly like this. Now, some other bloggers, they may have theirs looking like this, but personally, I don't want mine to look like this. You can just go to the shop page and just shop from there. But to get it back to your original home page, all you need to do is go over here and click home page settings and see how it has two home pages. So I click this one and now it's back to its regular home page. See, this is my regular home page. Doesn't this look way better? Yeah. So this is how you get it back to its regular home page. Now, this is what I'm hoping you can do instead of just deleting WooCommerce and having to start all over because I was not about to... Um, delete my WooCommerce store and having to put all that stuff back in there but I can show you back to now if I might do an experiment where I actually might leave it like this for a month and see how um the traffic is with people buying since like your store is right on the front page because like I said some bloggers do that but Personally, I don't like it like that. I'd rather just have its own section off to the side. So I'm going to change it back to like how I had my home page. And I'm going to click publish because that's going to save it. So yeah, don't <laughs> don't um delete your WooCommerce store. That was just a fast way to get it back. So let's make sure I'm going to go right here and click visit website and see my homepage is back up to normal guys. And when I click on shop, my shop is back to its normal page. So if you enjoy this video, please click the like button. Also give me a super shout out and thanks um if i'm talking like this because i'm getting over a cold so please bear with me thank you